Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. Question 15. Optical fiber cables are not required to be listed and marked where the length of the cable within the building measured from its point of entrance does not exceed blank and the cable enters the building from the outside and is terminated in an enclosure. Okay, so is that length 25 feet, 30 feet, 50 feet, or 100 feet? Okay, now we're talking about optical fiber cables and the cables with listing and marking. So th these are the things we're going to have to look at. Now there is a section in the code on optical fiber cables. So let's go to the index and find that if you don't know where that is right now. Here we are in our index, optical fiber cables, and it's article 770. So as we go down, we can see in Roman numeral 3 it's talking about within a building. However, our, our question asks when it enters the building and it wants the length of the cable within the building but it also talks about when it does enter the building so let's see if we can find something else that could uh, apply to our, our situation here so we're gonna go down and we're gonna have to scroll down a little bit to see outside and entering the buildings now this is 770 Roman numeral 2 so again, we can start there because it's going to start the cable, the fiber optic cable starts outside the building and enters it. And if we don't find what we want in Roman numeral 2, then we'll go to Roman numeral 3. Here we are at Roman numeral 2 of article 770. Okay, cables outside and entering the buildings. And so again, it's talking about unlisted cables and that was part of our question. And the first word here is unlisted. And as you start reading down this it gets it's asking where the length of the cable so we're going to have to go to the next page at the top to get the rest of the answer now this is almost word for word from what we want here it is measured from the point of entrance does not exceed 15 meters or 50 feet and the cable enters the building from the outside and is terminated in an enclosure so that's almost word for word of what our question is asking. So our distance is 50 feet for our answer. Now, I just want to scroll down just for a second to look. Here was Roman numeral 3, which we thought we might be having to look at in our index. So it was really close together, and you could have seen that if you had the actual code book in your hand, which you're supposed to have when you follow along. Now let me make a point here. This computer uh, code on computer which I'm using and I need it really to get my screenshots. It's magnificent and I love it. The thing is when you're going to take your examination you have to be the computer. Okay? Because anybody that knows how to do word searches can take this and they can know practically nothing about electrical work and get almost a perfect score on the test in four hours. Okay, but the test is designed to see what you know about electrical knowledge and can you find it in the code book. So that's why you need to use the code book. So anyway, to answer this question for the test, we will select choice number C, which is 50 feet. Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. If you find this video helpful, please consider donating using the PayPal link below. Thank you.